I don't want to try and convince you that you are not alone in your family or in your home or your life because I don't know what your situation is or how you feel or what you're going through. I'm not going to try and change your mind or even cheer you up. I do want to give you a few ideas um, to think about when you feel like you are alone and when you feel like you're unwanted and like nobody cares about you. I know how that feels. Sometimes those feelings of being alone and unwanted can actually lead to greater freedom and joy and creativity than you could ever experience when you're with people. For instance, when I feel like nobody cares what I do, I am free to do whatever I want. I can make YouTube videos where I'm sitting in the forest talking to you. I can walk around at four o'clock in the morning and dance in the middle of the street. Feeling alone and like no one cares is the source of a freedom and a joy and a creativity that you could never experience otherwise. Think about doing something that is you, something that truly expresses your your creativity, your uh, authenticity, your true self. Think about what it means to blossom into who God created you to be. Try something a little different and unique. Feeling like you're all alone is normal because it's kind of true. There is only one source of true love and deep connection and that really has to come within yourself. For me, it's spirituality. It's connecting with God, the Holy Spirit, the divine source of comfort, joy, creativity, beauty, love, light, life, freedom. There's this huge well of joy that's flowing and I feel alone. I am more in touch with that gush and rush of joy than I could ever be with people because people are distracting. It's important to have relationships, but it's also important to know how to handle your loneliness and how to handle feelings of being alone. And one way to handle that is to know that it's normal and even healthy to feel alone sometimes. Another thing that helps me is to question what I think. If you're struggling with the thought, nobody cares about me, and I'm all alone. Ask yourself, is it really true? Is it really true that nobody cares about you? You have no friends, you don't have a mom, you don't have a dad, no one is ever thinking about you? That's really sad, but I bet it's not true. I bet you could come up with one or two people who do care about you. Third thing to remember is that you won't always feel this way. These feelings of, I like to call it existential angst or loneliness, they come and go. But what really helps is to know that this is how I feel now and it's just temporary and it will pass. I'm gonna be surrounded by people and I won't feel like I'm all alone. In fact, I'll wish I was all alone. A fourth thing to remember is that you matter more than you know. You don't realize that people are thinking about you and remembering who you are in ways that you don't know because you're not with them. I actually have a very small circle of family and friends, like minuscule. And if I can drum up two or three people who I know care about me, I know that you have more people in your life that uh, you think of that, um, that do care about you. You matter to them more than you realize.